So best year ever. Why are we talking about best year ever? Well, it's kind of funny. Back in 2019, our office manager here at Excellent Supply went and bought a yearly calendar, which we do each year. And in 2019, she purchased this calendar for 2020. See what it says on it? Best year ever for 2020. We kind of keep it now as a joke, kind of an LOL. Because as you know, <laughs> 2020 was clearly not anybody's best year. We went into the pandemic, the lockdown. Not a great situation. Well, now we've been through most of 2021 and I've got to say, things are still kind of a mess. We're still under a pandemic. And what's made matters even more crazy is the supply chain situation. We can't get products like we used to. And, and I'm sure you're seeing that everywhere, no matter what you're shopping for, stuff just isn't there and there's long waits and we have to pre-order things. What caused all this craziness? Well, a few things. For one, the canal where the uh, shipping cargo uh, ship got, got lodged sideways in there and blocked up the canal for several days. That backed up everything, and it was already a mess to start with. In addition to that, in our industry, and in many industries, that freeze last spring, something as crazy as a freeze in Texas, messed up the petroleum pipeline. Well, guess what? Everything that we use, a lot of it has petroleum derivatives in it. Then there's also been unprecedented online shopping, which has really just kind of put a, a greater demand on the whole system that's already at a bottleneck to start with. And then on top of it, as you've already seen, the labor has dried up in many industries. It's very, very hard to find employees. So now there's a shortage of people to push things through the pipeline. All in all, it's just been a nutty year. Some of the things that have affected us. Now go back to that uh, freeze in Texas, the petroleum products. Well, some of the raw ingredients uh, some of them are petroleum derivatives. For example, polymers, can't get them. Pushed everything way back. Real problem there. Uh, bonnets, bonnets come in from Asia. All microfiber comes from Asia. Been a backlog on bonnets. We've had a real struggle trying to keep bonnets in the pipeline. Symex machines. Symex is now being manufactured in England again, as it originally had been for many years. Well, getting those Symex machines in from England, again, shipping problems. CRB machines, they come from Austria. I can't even tell you when we're going to see those. It's really been a nightmare trying to get CRB machines and we're hopeful. We're, we're hoping we're going to see some soon. Vibes, Orbot Vibes, they can't get workers in California to build these things and assemble them. Same problem again. Even caps and bottles to put our products in we can't get. We can't get boxes. And if we can get the stuff, even getting things shipped there's a shortage of people working in the shipping industry. We've actually had containers get stuck at terminals and they can't get out of the terminals because there's no truck drivers to move the product that's sitting in a terminal out of the terminal. Crazy times, to say the least. So here's what we're doing here at Excellent Supply to try to mitigate these problems. To the best of our ability, we've been ordering in bulk, trying to stay ahead of the curve as much as possible and order extra quantities so that we can have what you need when you place your order. We're also doing everything that we can as far as our suppliers to stay ahead of the curve, placing orders for the next order out. For example, Cymex machines, we have an order on the next shipment, not just this shipment, to keep these machines in the pipeline ahead of the curve doing everything we can to try to alleviate the problems that we're seeing with this crazy supply situation that we've seen develop this year. We also appreciate the fact that you're being patient too. I hope you recognize we're gonna to continue to do all we can to get through this, but we appreciate your patience too as we try to get the products that you need. So, 2020 brought us the pandemic and the lockdown. 2021 brought us the supply chain bottleneck that's just really messed everything up. So what will 2022 bring? Will it be the best year ever? Well, let's face it. We're entrepreneurs here at Excellent Supply and you're an entrepreneur as well. What do entrepreneurs do? They take a situation, they figure out how to make it work. And that's the sign of a true entrepreneur. And we're going to continue to put that entrepreneurial spirit into what we're doing here at Excellent Supply. And I want to encourage you to do the same. Because as you look at it, the old analogy is the glass half full or is it half empty? 
Well, really, it's up to us to see the good in it and to continue to work hard and make things go forward. We're going to do everything that we can to help you. We want to help you be successful. With our supply line that we have at Excellent Supply, we don't have a huge line. We have a very specific and specialized line, and we do our best to keep those products loaded in the pipeline, and we're going to continue to do all we can to provide you what you need. So we'll see what happens in 2022. Hopefully things will stabilize a little bit, but I wouldn't be surprised if things get even crazier because that just seems to be the way things are going. But at any rate, everything we do here, we're gonna stay committed to doing our best to help you max your NCAP. So thank you for watching this episode of NCAP TV. And please hit the like, subscribe, comment below. We appreciate it when you do that as well. Have a great day.